welcome um virgos i want to say thank you for being here thank you for being back virgos let's see what's coming out for you virgos we are working with archangel raphael in this week we have two message for you virgos message one message two this week is a fourth week the week begins from the 20th until the 26th is a fourth week so laughter is the best medicine there, Archangel Raphael, thank you for reminding me to detach and find the humor and irony within every human drama, okay? So there's a lot of dramas about around you, but laughter is the best remedy. Massage. Dear Archangel Raphael, please help me. Know that I deserve to receive a message and other self-care transformation but i want to advise some of you about mass massage a lot of people like to go for a massage and it is best um to go to um a spa for massage i see a whole lot of these vietnamese is coming up with massage parlors but um massage is very important just like uh, um um massage is zero um just um yeah so you have to be very careful who you let massage you okay um because people can be taking your energy while they massage you and a lot of people is not aware of this so, so be aware so good news laughter um um whatever the drama that is going on around you you have to create some form of laughter in your life so we see the energy of for you guys the queen of pentacles in the reverse you virgos whatever is transpiring you ladies are in the reverse i see secrets came out about your ladies information is coming out i see some issues is removing away um from you ladies and i see it has to do with family issue so a lot of you are dealing with family issues in this week, okay? A whole lot of family issues. So I see you Virgos um, ladies are going to be victorious and successful, and that is good. And I see you're trying to find strength to deal with some deceptive situation that was created and some secrets that is coming out. I see you turn your back and some of you wanted to leave a situation behind but you are victoriously coming out of an issue with a family issue and you're staying okay so you wanted to move away because you were having some issues you found out some family secrets and you were trying to find strength some of you decide to um move away um leave this situation behind but i see that you virgos are going to be staying okay so whatever that was happening and transpiring, you were definitely um, trying to um, get away from some family issues that was going on, especially you older ladies. But I see what is happening and what is transpiring is that I see you're going to be just staying and dealing with the situation. So ladies 50 years and older, I see you're dealing with issues with the kids, issues with friends, um, especially friends are coming up. So ladies 50 years and older, you're kind of in the reverse because you're dealing so is situation with your your friends and I see negative energy um that is um over you and your friends or your family and you ladies are kind of resolving that situation. Then I see um you ladies are looking for a new start. You have found out some information about a family and you are looking for a new start. I see you're going to be successfully overcoming some deceptive play with an a young Aries and um, some lies. So secrets come out about this fire sign man. This could have been your husband, Aries, Leo, or Sagittarius. So a whole lot of secrets comes out about him and his work and how he creates his wealth. And they are seeing how he creates his wealth and secrets about his wealth because they're realizing this man has been lying and deceptive. A whole lot of information about. Uh, um, money with this man has came out uh, and the deceptiveness that this man has created in order to receive financial stability in his world the materialistic wealth this is good some of you i see some issues and situation where you're going to be resolving i see you're communicating clearly with your mother or your wife and this is really really positive 
I see some of you um, are thinking about taking a new uh, step moving forward. I see you're looking in the future and you're going to decide to move forward. I see you young people are going to be having a new start or is hoping for a new start moving in the future. So um, you ladies, there's some family issue, but this is going to be over. I see you ladies were dealing with some family issue because of deceptive people, um, outside influences that was affecting your family. And I see love is going to be offered to you. I see your kids is going to be turning around and thanking you ladies for really resolving whatever this family issue is. I see your kids are offering you Virgo ladies and love. Oh. Ooh, ladies, 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 you are back. So ladies 50 years and older, you're going to be victorious over a deceptive situation that people was created some deceptiveness around your family. And I see that um, some of you ladies are going to be receiving help from a Pisces Cancer or a Scorpion. This is an older person, the same age group. So it could be your sister, or it could be a friend, but it's coming up as someone who is uh, with a family. I see an organization institution is going to be um, resolving an issue and help some of you Virgos to get out of some issues. And I see you're going to be successful over and cooperation institution, whatever that has happened and transpired. I see a whole lot of success where you guys are going to be successful over some deceptiveness. I see justice is in your favor. Young people who were dealing with some stressful legal issues in a cooperation institution, I see you're going to be overcoming these stressful situation and resolving the situation. A tower moment came down. Um, twice the energy of the tower. So you guys have twice the energy of the tower. So whatever that was happening and transpired, I see a huge tower moment came down on a cancer and uh, Aries. A huge tower moment came down for an Aries man. This man could be a brother or a family member, or it could be um your business partner or a boss, but it's coming up as a husband or a family member. I see um, some of you who are widows, I see some regrets. I, I see you're unhappy and there are some regrets. With who was a widow, the widowed people, I see some regrets because the end has came for your wife. So I see some of you men, your wife has passed away. Um, I see debt um, is coming up, transition, debt is coming up. So I see transition and the end for a Leo, whoever this Leo is and whatever is transpiring, I see transition and the end for a Leo. Whoever that was having some issues with a Leo, I see they're finding out the truth about this Leo and the deceptiveness of, of this Leo. So... There was a lot of deceptiveness of this Leo. So I see some of you saw some uh, situation. Some of you were dealing with some false height and deceptiveness and lies. False height, deceptiveness and lies. So this week is where you guys are going to be finding out about some false height, deceptiveness and lies. And you Virgos are trying to protect yourself and to keep away these really nasty, deceptive people out of your life. It has to do with a woman and a child. Some of you is your wife. You're going to be finding out that your wife um is, is very deceiving so you men be aware if your wife is an aquarian or a gemini you're going to be finding out about some deceptiveness of your wife that you were not aware of and you're going to be ending this so whoopsie daisy it is a lot there is no question a lot is happening, a lot is transpiring. Um, so if you're married to an a fire sign man, uh, 40 years or older, it could be your grandfather, you're going to be finding about some secret about his wealth. But uh, um, the way he creates his wealth is very deceptive. And that, that, you know, there is where the secrets is going to be coming out about this man and his wealth and how he creates his wealth. 
um, some of you, you could have kids or friends that is a Cancer and a Aries. I see a tower moment is coming down. I see you ladies. So, um, whoever this Cancer and this Aries is have uh, created some issues for your child and place negative, uh, negative form, negativeness over your child if your child is a scorpion. And I see a tall moment is coming down for these two people. So it's a Cancer and an Aries, and they're young, between the age of 18 and 45. And it's as if they put negative forces over your child. And I see you ladies is ruining and ripping and removing the lies and deceptiveness. And tower moment, twice is it the tower moment. This week is going to affect the ladies 50 years and older because I see you ladies 50 years and older is helping your family and protecting your family and your children. A tower moment is coming down for a man and his wife. The truth is coming out. A tower moment is coming down. Some of you, your wife is going to be passing away. Um, in this week, there, there is some unhappiness. Uh, um and a tower moment is coming down i see some of you ladies are going to be um standing up and um working and talking and um helping your kids so whatever is happening and transpiring you're going to be talking and helping your kids to resolve some issue and some situation i see you women are going to be using the sword of truth in this week it doesn't really matter who you are but you're going to be standing in and using the sword of truth in this week whatever the false height and deceptiveness that is being created so i see at the end um is coming to some uh, lies and deceptive um, um play of a pisces whoever this pisces is uh, um, this Pisces has created some lies and deceptiveness. And I see a corporation institution has seen what the Pisces has created, the lies and the deceptiveness. And I see they're going to take down this, this, um, the, this Pisces, um, a transition end is coming into a Pisces to the lies and deceptiveness that, and, uh, that the Pisces has created. Um, so um, some of you could be a sister, um, some of you, it could be a brother, whoever the spices is, I see this is happening. So when we look at devastation um, uh, for a young Aries Leo and a cancer, I see um, love is going to be offered because I see your child is going to be finding out that you were the one who took these people down. You men, your wife could be passing away and I see a whole lot of sadness. She might be sick, but she's going to pass away. I see you're dealing with a whole lot of sadness. I see you young people are going to be having a new start because people have found out the deceptiveness that was created around you. And I see your mom has helped you or you are going to finally be in release because you young people are protecting yourself because you want a new start. Then um, we see the energy of uh, transition is coming up because I see you ladies win a situation. There were some issues and I see that you and a Pisces Cancer, it could be a sister, it could be a family member, it could be an in-law, a sister-in-law, as um, you could be a mother. Whoever this person is together with you are going to be winning um, some deceptiveness that people try to create around your child. And this could be a godmother or a um a aunt that loved this child very much but you and this person whoever you are you and a cancer pisces cancer woman is going to be victorious and celebrating um a success um with a corporation um because of some deceptiveness that a leo has created and i see an in debt for a pisces for some deceptiveness that has transpired if your mom is a Pisces and your mom has passed away, your mom is helping you from uh, the spirit world to release this. But some of you men are dealing with your wife and you're going to be finding out some really deceptive situation that your wife has created and some lies and deceptiveness, what your wife has created in your world. So be aware of this men because you're going to be finding out something about your wife and your wife is not being honest 
about our materialistic stability or your wife has been stealing from you or some deceptiveness with your wife and lies so you you're going to find out and this is for people who are married okay i love you guys i gotta go namaste